So hi friend, this is Amit and you are watching my channel Information and Educational Video. So here I am with a complete mark versus percentile detail and the minimum marks that you need to have in order to be eligible for the advanced exam. For today's exam, that is July 27th, SIFT 1, SIFT 2, complete information I will try to provide you as you all know, SIFT 1 and SIFT 2 both was having similar a similar type of question but SIFT 1 was having a little bit more tougher question as I have got the feedback. You may say that SIFT 2 was a little bit more harder but as far as question we are concerned and the pattern that I have seen in the question so shift 1 was a little bit tough and in this session of JMS examination and we are providing a little bit tougher question in a shift 1 examination each day in shift 2 it is also moderate but a little bit easier than the shift 1 you may disagree and it will be verified on the result day once you will get the result but as far as my information is concerned I am providing you the information it may be different and also because if every step of a student will appear in shift 2 examination then even if the paper is less difficult you will be getting better percentile at low marks also so this is as, as uh, this is very simple it can be done also but uh, as of now that uh, shift one was a little bit tougher so if you have appeared in shift one you can relate with that that is i am providing you the complete range of marks that is for 99.9 percentile your marks should be 270 to 225 so if your shift is second it will be more closer to 225 and if your shift is first then it will be more closer to 217 mark that is it can be 218 to 19 to 20 also i can't predict 100 percent correct but i am providing your range of marks if you are getting this type of marks you will be sure to get 99.9 percentile and for previous day exams and it is 26 or 25 also i have provided and very soon i will try to provide you with shift is among the hardest shift as of now and also i will try to provide you the chances of third attempt as of now because most of the students are demanding for that so very soon I will try to provide you that video in the same channel. So next if you talk about for 99.8 percentile 210 to 217 marks for 99.6 200 to 208 and for 99.4 194 to 198 marks and for 99 174 to 183 marks and for 98 152 to 160 marks and for 97 it is 144 to 150 marks and for 96 it is 128 to 135 marks and now if you talk about for 95 115 to 123 marks and for 93 96 to 104 marks and one more thing i would like to inform you here that is once your examination will be done that is j advance also thereafter josa counseling will be starting and at that time i will be guiding you completely for the counseling process that is choice filling uh, physical verification document verification decision making everything so that you will able to join the best college at your rank whatever you will get and it is not only limited to josa but for csab as well as other counseling for other interest exam also I will be guiding you so that you will be able to join the best college whatever available for you and also I will be doing the college comparison for you so that you will be able to join the best college with best possible branch if you want you can contact me that time there is a nominal charge for that but once you join it is sure that you will be uh, getting the best out of your time. So now let's continue this video that is for 90, uh, 76 to 84 uh, marks and for 85, 59 to 66. And for 80, it is 50 to 60 marks and for 75, 43 to 50 and for 70, 37 to 40 marks and for 65, 32 to 35 and for 60, it is uh, 28 to 31 and for 50, 24 to 27 and for 40 percentile, only 15 to 18 marks will be required. So this was about the marks versus percentile data for 27th shift 1, shift 2. So here is the information. Now let's talk about the expected cut of marks for J advanced. It is minimum marks that you need to have. For general 66 to 71 and cut off percentile will be 86 to 88 it can be 84 83 also because this year number of student is low and for ews 36 to 41 marks and the percentile will remain same that is 64 to 66 and for obc 38 to 42 marks sc 24 to 28 st 15, uh, 14 to 17 and pwd if you have solved any one question you will be eligible for J advanced exam. So, so this was all about the marks versus percentile and minimum marks to be eligible for J advanced exam. And category wise, I have discussed everything. So, hope you find this information very useful for you. So, please try to subscribe to this channel so that you will be getting all the update. And very soon, I will try to provide the safe rank for NIT, Triple IT, GFTI, and minimum marks for IIT college so that you can target for J advanced. So, everything will be provided in the same channel. So, please try to subscribe so that you will get all the update at the right time. And also, I will get some support from your side. So, thanks again for watching this video. Please try to subscribe.